or a steady incompressible friction flow. The Bernoulli equation may be applied on a streamline. On a classical application, is the pitot tube. I line along a streamline. The pitot tube enables to measure the total head, the geometric head, and in turn, the fluid velocity. Based upon dimensional and theoretical consideration, the skin friction boundary shear stress may be measured when a pitot tube is lying on a boundary in a developing boundary layer. This application is referred to as a Preston tube. Two theoretical derivations follow. When a pitot tube is lying on the wall, it measures the velocity at a distance normal to the wall, roughly equal to half of the pitot tube diameter, outer diameter. First, assuming that the tube is within the inner wall layer in a smooth turbulent boundary layer, the boundary shear stress is proportional to the measured velocity. Preston tube may also be used in the wall region of smooth and rough turbulent boundary layers. Using a Prandtl mixing length model, a theoretical expression of the skin friction boundary shear stress in the wall region may be derived, with the boundary shear stress proportional to the square of the measured velocity. A detailed validation was conducted in open channel flow, showing a monotonic relationship between the boundary shear stress and the measured velocity. The result follows closely the solution of the Prandtl mixing length model. This is illustrated on this comparison with a theoretical solution with a red solid line and the experimental data in blue symbols. The theoretical solution in the whole region is an expression of the skin friction boundary shear stress as a function of the measured velocity by the pitot tube lying on the boundary. The development implies that the velocity is measured at a distance greater than the viscous sublayer thickness. Let us look at two results obtained in open channel flow. This first figure presents the contour map of the bed shear stress beneath an ondular hydraulic jump with the flow from the top right to the bottom left. The second figure was the contour plot of the dimensional boundary shear stress on the bed of an open channel with small triangular baffles on the left bottom corner with the flow from the left to the right. This project was part of the development of fish friendly box cover to assist the upstream passage of small body mass fish. In this case, on the left, a juvenile silver perch resting upstream of a bottom corner. The Preston tube is a basic application of the pitot tube operation in turbulent boundary layer flow. Using the fundamental concepts of basic fluid mechanics, turbulent flow, and open channel hydraulics, they are discussed in a number of relevant YouTube video movies in the same playlist.